On October 2nd, the head of the Republican Guard Unit in Goma, Colonel Mike Mikumbe, was sentenced to death by the military court for killing 57 civilians in Goma on August 30th, according to the latest official figures. Three other soldiers were sentenced to 10 years in prison and two others were exonerated of all charges. The lawyers of the accused, who had argued for an ekitao, have announced their intention to file an appeal. The death penalty is often imposed in the Democratic Republic of Congo, but it has not been carried out for 20 years. It is systematically commuted to life imprisonment in the country. In his final argument on Friday, the chief prosecutor presenting the execution did not ask for the death penalty, but asked for Colonel Mike Mikumbe, the main accused, to receive life imprisonment. The court retained the charge of murder rather than crimes against humanity. The prosecution had also asked for the five other accused to receive sentences ranging from 10 to 20 years. The United Nations Peacekeeping Mission in Congo, known as the United Nations Organization Stabilization Mission in the Democratic Republic of Congo, has faced protests since last year, spurred partly by complaints that it failed to protect civilians against decades of military violence.